I'm always delighted to be able to tell people about the concept of our solar house. But before I tell you about the house, I'd like to tell you why we decided to do it. Our Midwestern family lived in California for five years, and then when we moved here, uh, it was about six years ago, some of the things that we had become accustomed to because of the energy crisis in California, the, uh, the sustainability issues they already have, um, things that we started learning how to do because we were there, we came here and it was like, it was, uh, you know, people had no concept of what we were, you know, the way we lived. And so we wanted to buy a house and we looked at the houses here and it seemed that builders were still building the same thing that they'd always built, only bigger. This land used to be part of the Big Grove, which was one of the few wooded areas of Champaign County. It had been cleared for farming 150 years ago. So our house is a, a, a passive solar house. Uh, that's the design of the, the building itself, and that's why you see most of the windows along the south side of the house there. The, the front of the house faces east, and that's the narrow side, and uh, so there are very few windows on the east and west side, and um, the, the long uh, side of the long south side of the house uh, allows us to have solar panels on the roof. And it, as you're looking at my house, that blue roof, it contains solar panels. Passive solar is a, a marvelous way to let nature make your house comfortable so that you don't have to spend a lot of money on energy to make it that way. So our house, besides the windows, it also, it, the windows open for, it, there's good airflow throughout the house. We have a central stair, which allows the, the heating the heat that's created by the windows to rise to the upstairs. The center part of the house, the part that sticks out there on the south side, is a sun space, and it's got a lot of thermal mass. There's brick inside the house as well as concrete, and it's a space that's separate from the rest of the house so that we can close it off if it's too cold or open it up and let the heat throughout if we want to, to do that. We also have a geothermal system, which is another form of solar. Geothermal just uses the sun's heat that's stored in the earth and uh, we have that too. When we decided to build this house, it actually took us five years to accomplish this, and along the way, I became a dealer for solar products. Um, I started giving seminars about green building and solar energy, and built a subdivision, because it was so hard to do, and we felt like it shouldn't be that hard to do, so we thought we would make it easier for people to do the same thing, and by building houses that are similar near each other, we all keep each other's property values up.